O3. Okay, so we have 18 electrons. As it turns out, ozone looks like this. Boom. And we'll do lone pair, lone pair, lone pair, lone pair. And you are absolutely welcome to confirm this if you want to. Um, well, actually, you know what? This is not a charged species. Therefore, I will not put brackets around it. However, it does have another resonance structure. Double bond can be on the other side. This can be single. This can be double. So we get three lone pairs here, one lone pair there, two lone pairs here. Now we have three different types of oxygen. We have this oxygen, this oxygen, this oxygen. O1. The valence is 6. Let's look at this one. Call it O1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 are assigned. It has a formal charge of negative 1. O2. Well, let me make these electrons a little bit clearer. Those looks like three electrons there. That's not going to work. Okay. Now, this one is normal oxygen is 6. The valence of this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This one is plus 1. The third oxygen is the normal valence of 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It is 0. Minus 1 plus 1 plus 0 is 0. Notice ozone carries a 0 charge. However, one of these oxygens is carrying a formal charge of plus 1, this one, and the other is carrying a formal charge of negative 1, this one. This is the complete resonance structure along with formal charge. Okay, so that's it. That's our discussion of resonance and formal charge. Thank you for joining us for AP Chemistry, and thank you for joining us here at uh, educator.com. We'll see you next time.